Good evening, CMG family and distinguished guests. It has been four long years since our last EOTY, and it's incredibly good to be back. As we gather to honor our executive of the year, we first recognize the remarkable contribution bestowed by our last chairman. In my opinion, Mr. Rajmahendran's legacy has two aspects we will carry forward. Firstly, we have a considerable history of achievement. These achievements and successes encompass our numerous subsidies across diverse fields, our notable standing in Sri Lanka's corporate landscape, an unwavering commitment to staff development, and our significant contributions to society. The second part of Mr. Rajmahendran's legacy lies in his indomitable spirit, which we often refer to as the courage to be different. This spirit has been instilled in each of us who have had the privilege of working with him. And in turn, we uplift and pass it on to those who follow in our footsteps. It is this brave spirit that makes our group a formidable force in Sri Lanka as well as across the globe. In the last few years, events have transpired so numerous and absurd, it's hard to comprehend. We are not an ordinary corporate in any way, and mourning the profound loss of my father, our chairman in 21, I found myself not left with a company, but a purpose. A purpose based on our values and this intrinsic legacy woven into the fabric of who we are. CMG is a livelihood for thousands. CMG is also a voice for millions. We find ourselves in challenging times as a nation and as part of a world undergoing turbulence. Yet we will continue to draw strength from our achievement and embrace our indomitable spirit, a spirit driven by courage, optimism, innovation, and faith in ourselves, our colleagues, and our country. It is through these qualities that we rise to overcome the obstacles before us and grow, as we always have done in times of adversity. This deeply entrenched, never give up attitude ensured we did not stop operations for even a single day during lockdowns and crisis. Our seamless transition through loss is a tribute to all of you, whose dedication made it possible for me to carry forward the work required as your chairman. More recently, when faced with a shortage of dollars for imports and the central bank running negative foreign exchange reserves and commercial banks finding it difficult to obtain dollars, our senior managers showed incredible ingenuity and resourcefulness. Motivated by a courage to be different, you worked tirelessly to secure the foreign exchange needed to keep our factories running. Not a single factory was slowed down by the national economic meltdown. Our operations continued daily. As for our media, in a disaster, all lies look to us for reliable, accurate information. I know all of you in the media business worked 24-7 to keep Sri Lanka informed during this period, catching whatever sleep you could on whatever surface you could find. We shoulder a great responsibility, and to our pride, you all served your country with great honor and patriotism. Today we are strong, and we continue our strategic expansion. And I could have not done this without your support. Executives, board of directors, and CEOs, I extend my heartfelt gratitude to each one of you. I extend to Mr. Sunil Kanojia, Group CEO, our most grateful thanks for having stood with us through the trying times of COVID and the economic crisis, when he very well could have gone back home to India enjoying his family life in peace. His business acumen and strong management led us through some very dark days. We must remember that CMG is more than just a business. We are committed to the responsible development of Sri Lanka. We encompass our nation's social development as part and parcel of our progressive vision for success. Especially important to us is our homegrown CSI initiative, Gammadda. The Gammadda movement was founded by my father over a decade ago as an attempt to make sense of all the poverty we saw reported on our news. He empowered a young team to go to the people, and they did. Perhaps nobody understood the depth of vision then, but today Sri Lanka and the world can see the, and feel the impact of this noble endeavor. 
The Gamanta movement is now perhaps the largest grassroots movement in Sri Lanka and will continue to serve the people even at the most difficult of times. We can adapt to change and we will ensure our positive impact continues for generations to come. Our indomitable spirit and achievements mean little if we cannot continue to uplift those who need us most. We have a clear vision for Sri Lanka and the ability to make our goals and dreams a progressive reality for many. We believe in our country and our people and we have invested in exactly that. 2023 marks the 75th anniversary of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, a landmark document that enshrined fundamental human rights for all people. CMG partnered with the UNHCR to host a series of events in 2022 under the theme Dignity, Freedom and Justice for All. And for Human Rights 75, we will conduct a year-long commemoration that includes educational workshops to teach human rights, cultural performances to celebrate diversity, and community projects to give people that opportunity to make a difference close to home. We are confident that the people of Sri Lanka will join us in promoting and protecting human rights for all. After all, we are a nation that has through history rejected oppressors. It is not only our right, but it is in our blood to be free. Some try to tell us we have too much freedom. <clears throat> but it's not our freedom that led to a fallen economy it is not our freedom that has led us, led one in three children being unable to have a proper breakfast before school. And it is not our freedom that caused every rupee you have worked your entire life to earn to be worth less than half of what it is in just a few years. Every country evolves to a point in history where it can become a well-developed nation. And we are at that cusp. We now see people rejecting problems and propaganda, shrugging off macro-political events and demanding change. Sri Lanka is again at the crossroads in national development. I believe this island has the potential to advance exponentially. CMG is committed to driving that growth responsibly with professional integrity. The group has a long and rich history. It began as a trading office in Petta, and with the efforts of many stalwarts over the years, it has become what it is today, a globally reputed conglomerate. We are only seven years away from our centenary. By empowering our leaders early and streamlining the feedback process, we have created a virtuous cycle of growth and innovation with our frontline employees, our valued stakeholders. The future is ours to craft, and today we welcome many, many new executives to CMG. As you find your place in our diverse landscape, please take ownership of your values and our story, for you are now very much part of an extraordinary journey. We are here to create leaders most of our top tier staff have risen up through the ranks and carved their own niche. Whatever the challenges, the possibilities with CMG are enormous. To our executives, we believe in you. How will you use your moment? What will your legacy be? Those are the questions I hope you will be asking yourselves as we gather to honor individual achievement. To all the executives here, this is CMG 2023. We will push forward, we will keep rising, and we will lead. We don't want no other way. Thank you all for your service.